Hey everyone, welcome back to Mad Pack. So this weekend, this last weekend on Saturday, I released a bonus episode and it was uh, for two reasons. One, because for some reason I've been having, or YouTube's been having some uh, problems processing my videos and a lot of you guys haven't been able to see them in HD and some people have been saying they haven't been able to play them at all and I haven't changed anything, but Saturday, the bonus video I put up saying, you know, I'm sorry, it was kind of out of my control, and I can't re-upload them because I upload them like seven days in advance, and then they're gone, and I was out of town. So I tested going back to MP4, which was what I used to do like early on in season one, and a lot of my other videos that I play on this computer. So... If you guys saw that, you saw where we advanced to on this. Um, also, the, but this will be the first video that I've of the, of the normal series that I'm try, switching over. Hopefully by now, uh, this is same day that you know it's same day I uploaded the other video, so I don't know yet for sure. But I'm gonna render this one out with the MP4, and hopefully that works out as well. Now, what we need to do is we need to get our next little thing here, which is I believe snow cookie. So we need to sleep. And if you guys missed that episode, we made a Baconator. We we didn't do too much. We made a Baconator. We got this heat sword. Um, we got this little pigs chilling in there. We've got to keep an eye on. No, oh, we're okay for now. I think the closest snow is, um, is right over there. Pretty sure. I'm just, I'm just trying to get to the point where I can get my, my boots going, you know? So I can get some movement. See, I think that, yeah, this is the closest snow here. Um, I don't have any boats sitting around. All right, let's just run for it. We can check on our on our quarry on our way by as well. So I'm I'm happy you guys have stuck around. Happy you guys are enjoying the second season. You know, sometimes I feel like I almost need to rush things. Uh, to make sure that the content, you know, stays active. But, man, I just, there's so much to do in these things. And there's a lot of building, like, not building, but a lot of, um, like, crafting of, like, you know, getting the dark craft stuff up to speed and all that that goes into this that I don't really want to shortchange myself or you guys, too. So I hope that, um, you know, the way that I'm playing is, is okay because uh, I really enjoy it. I know a lot of you guys do, too. Um, you know, obviously it takes a little while to get, um, to get things. Did I not see this place before to get things ranked up and going? Yeah, it's just one of those nothing buildings. All right. So yes, I brought my shovel. I made a shovel. Why? Why not? <laughs> okay. So we need some, some of this stuff. All right. And while we're here, we'll just get a few of them. Might as well, right? Moink. All right, so snow cook. Okay, snow cookies. I think you just put it in there like that. And they stack. Nice. There we go. 34 snow cookies. N Ow! Bushes! <laughs> the bushes! Hey! In my bonus episode, one of those was infernal and mean and almost killed me. But disappeared, actually. So when I was attacking the infernal one, the other one attacked me. And look at that. I love that. When, you, when you're cruising around, all of a sudden you found a chest that you had made at some point. <laughs> Sheep, get out of the water. It's bad for your wool. All right. Let's see. Where? Almost looks like we're... Our armor is... Seen better days. We got a couple of drops. We were down um, in that little cave area where we found that big underground dungeon type thing. And we were just hitting through the wall. We got uh, this stuff drop. Fire protection, protection leggings. <clears throat> Not the best, but... All right. I just think that things, like, things can pick up really good once I get the ability to move around faster. Speed and wing on on my dart boots it's really gonna help we can we can go place like if i get an idea that i want to go over there we can just go boom we're going you know it's not like well i'll make my way over there 
doing a bunch of other things and we'll do it next episode you know something like that so bear with me people this is this is like a ride that we take together and enjoy it i i haven't had a series like mad pack for a long time that i've enjoyed so much besides like the meaty craft series i really like the meaty craft stuff um <clears throat> but you know for a while there false i think i'll probably have to make a sword you know for a while there and and this is just um real talk it's not when I talk about stuff like this, I'm not complaining. We're just talking. Um, you know, the views dropped way off. And, and I can understand that because it's like, ah, meaty craft. It's just Minecraft. You know, some stuff gets old. But the idea of meaty craft is so unique. You know, it's not just talking about the game. It's telling stories, real life stuff, experiences, advice, things like that. While we're playing, we do a lot of building. And I haven't run a meaty craft in a long time because, like I said, it seemed like people didn't want to see it. They'd rather see, like, the modded stuff. Um, okay, so we're going to put a snow cookie on there. Look at it, 22, 22, 22. How do you like that? On these swords, like, this could be a sword that we're going to use for a while. Um, we're going to put a snow cookie on it. That'll give us freezing, right? And then I think we want just want to go, like, damage. Like, damage for, oh, hmm. You know what the thing is? We're only going to be able to get damage four until we unlock some of these. Other. Let's just do it. Let's do it. Let's put that on there. Put a snow cookie. And we'll go for max damage as much as we can right now. This should take us to the next level. We're ready to advance. Let's do it. Let's do it. This one is damage for heat sword. So I have a damage for heat sword. Now we'll have a damage for freezing sword. I have an option for each one. It's pretty good. <clears throat> a lot of points for the next tier. Look at that. Oh no, is that the total points I have? So I don't know. We'll see. We'll see when this finishes. Oh, 320. Okay, 320. Oh cool, it's a different... Um, it has a different look to it. I'm thinking we should... Fill it with force. Don't you guys think so? I think we should. 10,000 force. I mean, freezing with damage 4 is a pretty good sword. I mean, obviously later on we can get more damage out of it. But um, yeah, I think it's worth filling it up. See, because like this one's already taken some damage. And I, we're going to switch to this. The, the, good, the better thing about freezing versus the heat sword is that freezing like locks them... It, it stuns them. You know, it, it like freezes them in place, obviously. Let's see how they... Oh, it looks good. It has like a, a turquoise color. All right. Now, I want to see... Where? Please tell me. Oh, yes. The traditional symbol of the freedom and avion flu. This... Oh, this is the gas tier. Tier gives me strength and regen. The gas tier... Um, this is floating set. Invisibility potion. Pretty sure it's a potion of some kind again. I'm just a sentence, perhaps. If I could just... Night vision. Invisibility and night vision potions. A uh, gas tier. Rock feather. Rock feather is what we've been waiting for, you guys. I'm pretty sure. I think. I forget how to make it. Rock's feather. Feather dust, feather glowstone. How do we make feather dust? Force grinding a feather. Makes sense, right? <laughs> Makes sense. Let's uh do two of them. So we have a force grinder here. And then glowstone dust? We should have some... I mean, I could break... I, what am I doing? Glowstone dust. We should have some... Somewhere. If not, I'll just break one of the... One of these guys out here. Uh, let's see. Let's put a torch in its place. How about way down here? We'll get this guy. And this guy. There we go. We've got six. That's good. That'll work for me. All right. So we should have two feather dusts. Uh, let's see. Iron powder. 
Still, we're still doing our iron. We've got a lot of iron built up. What? Let's see here. Um, copper, 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 gold, gold. So we have some gold and some tin here too. I think these are these were byproducts of 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 other ones. You know, it gives you byproducts when you do one. It it does two different dusts. Wouldn't mind doing some more gold when that's done. It's almost done. Okay, so we needed glowstone. We needed feather dust, and we need feather. All right, now we're going to want some sugar, too, because we're going to want speed. We're going to want speed and flight. Um, this will be, this should be the first time we make this, so let's see. Let's put the gold up in there. Oh, what was the, um, oh my gosh, you guys, what was the, like, the element that we put on there that, that causes them damage? Oh, I don't think we have that yet. That was, do you guys remember, oh, it was, uh, sturdy, sturdy. Can't remember what's, what gave us sturdy. Do you guys remember? Um, adva no, not advanced RE. Did we have sturdy falls? I don't think so. Well, either way, we're going to make up these boots. I'm trying to think what we should do with it. Oh, I didn't make the rock feather. I got to make, you got to make it. Um, there we go. Now we made it. Okay, so we have a rock feather. So that should give us wing. And then if we put some sugar in here, how much sugar can we put? Wow, we can go speed. I wonder if we should just do this now. Just go with mass speed and flight. Let's just do it. What the heck, right? What the heck? Why not? All right, well, that's go. Why don't I have these in here? All right, what other kind of dust do we have? We have some more gold powder. Do those. Give me something good, man. Give it to me good. I'm excited. But the other part is we made our magnetism on our boots. So we'll probably... Until we get, like, um... Until we get uh, sturdy, or... I, I think it's sturdy. Until we get that, we're going to not run other dark craft armor, probably. Wing and speed. All right. Let's see how we look. Okay, so now in this upgrade we have a, a we have a flight time, don't we? That was weird. I thought there was a flight time. Wait, it's dark outside. I'm not going out there. I'm trying to remember what the what the sturdy wasn't it was it diamond dust or something? Let me let me look here. Hold on. I, I got a um I made like a little notepad from the first season. Um there you can look at me. Uh let's see. Storage in a snow cookie. RE battery gives us armor. Rock feather gives us wing. Gas tier gives us healing. So the gas tier will be the healing rod. So that's important. Potion of Invisibility, Camouflage, Armor. You can Camouflage Armor. Night Vision gives you the Rod of Vision. And that's all I actually have written down here. Oh, Ender Pearl is the Rod of Return. Uh, Soul Wafer, Diamond Dust, Unbreaking, one on the pick. I thought there was something called Sturdy. And I think it's Diamond Dust. I think it's diamond dust gives you like sturdy on your on your boots, but we're not we're not close to that yet. You can see where we're at here. We've got to get a gas tier. We got to make the potions. We got to do that. And we still have what tier are we on? Actually, on we're only on tier five. Um, tier five of seven. But we can get, we can do five damage now. Anyway, let's uh, take a nap. I want to go try out our boots. 
You know, I've been thinking too. You know, it's just like I did in in the last season, thinking about the um. Let's see. I don't remember how to fly. Whoa! Wait a minute. What are all those people doing out there? There we go. Why is the thing not going down? I thought there was a, a flight limit. I see it up there. Get frozen. Alright, there is a flight limit, but it's not working, you guys. Oh, that's not good. How am I supposed to... How am I supposed to judge... How long to stay in the air? Oh, man. I hate gra... Whoa. But you're supposed to be on my side. Why is there so many people out here? Get frozen. See, frozen works so much better. You, s you can keep them away from you. Oh, it's on now. Okay, so... My flight meter doesn't go down. Alright, speed-wise... Speed-wise, you can run right through a bush. <laughs> but look at... So much better. Movement speed, right? I'm kind of bummed about the about the flight thing, though, because I don't... It, it's not going down. Even though, like, if I stay in the air, it, it will go down. If you let it go all the way down, um, it takes a lot longer to recharge. If you land before it goes all the way down, it recharges much quicker. But without the flight indicator working... Hmm. I wonder why it's not working. Not sure. I could find out. I could find out. I know that uh, Keenan Keehan, sorry, Keehan, uh, we've talked on Twitter before, and he, you know, had mentioned that if I had any questions or anything about stuff, to, you know, go ahead and tweet to him, and he would let me know. You know, uh, it's him and uh, John Bams that put this pack together. So if anyone's gonna know, it's gonna be those guys. So I could, I could always ask them um, if I'm having a kind of a game breaking type problem which i don't know it, it could be it could be like in a fight you know when i i really need some some height these guys over here try and come up here <laughs> oh no hey oh they came all right i didn't i didn't like wasn't serious about you coming up here i'm, I'm just was joking about it how the heck did he get up there Slowness and mining fatigue. Those the Naga, they've got um they got some pretty powerful debuffs for you. They hit you. I really would like to get to the point of um healing rod. I remember you guys saying something else though. I'm trying to remember exactly. Somebody said something like try this instead of the healing rod all the time. But the healing rod, you know, is pretty good. Oh, I didn't put any oops. I didn't put any all right, before we break our boots, let's go. Let's head back over there. I forgot to put um, any force in on them. And I'm going to break them. Oh, that's right. We can haul Boote across the wall. Look at, look at all of the side. Okay. Pay no attention to me. I'm not actually here. I'm not flying over your head right now. Bush. Of all the places to land, <laughs> I land right on a bush. <laughs> Moody time. Do you see what I mean? Oh, there's a feather. We See, I was collecting feathers from, from the get-go. Got one diamond. Oh, was that ferrous ore? Iron ore? I think this... Yeah, they, oh, this is done. This one's done. We can move our quarry. We can move our quarry, which is good. I think that the way I have that thing set up now... You know, I take that back. I was going to say, the way I have that set up now, we can probably... Move it over there. Um, but I, I don't think that's true yet. But what I do have, you guys, is... Let me um, let me juice these boots. I'm going to juice the boots up. Let me put some of this stuff away. Uh, let's see. Oh, and I got this working, too. It was my fault. It's not the... wasn't the... I got enough ink sacks. It's ridiculous. Um, feathers. We want to keep all this stuff. All right. So let's put... 
I think I'm keeping the diamonds in here for now. Let's put um, these in there, the feather in there. What else? I'm going to grind that stuff. Oh. Oh, that's out of... I need to make... Um, I need to make more... Let's make some more of these guys. These guys. Golden power sources. Oh, what was I saying? I was saying something important. I thought I was. What was I saying? Um, that I made something, I got some... Oh, 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 oh! That I found a... Uh, there we go. See, that's what I should have done before. I found a couple of um, um, blaze spawners. So we can... We got to go farm the uh, the blaze rods, right? So we can make ender tanks. And once we make ender tanks... Look at... Let's see. Ender tank. Uh, I mean, ender, ender chests, right? So we have ender chests. We have ender tanks. So ender chests, you see... We've got we've got 22 obsidian um, blaze rods. We can get blaze rods now. We can make ender chests. Now the other thing was you guys said a lot of you guys said that I should just spawn in a minium stone. Um, somebody said that John Bams did a one where he crafted one out of diamonds, but I heard it killed him. I heard it killed him and ended his hardcore world. So are you guys trolling or? Let's see, um, what, what am I looking for? Um, somewhere I've got 22, I thought I had, maybe, maybe I'm mistaken. Did I not have, I'm looking for obsidian guys. I thought I had, where would it be? Okay, I have two ender pearls and two blaze rods. It's not that big of a deal because I can go get some, but oh, it's in the it's in the uh, the quarry chest. It's in the quarry chest, guys. It's in the. Let's go look real quick. It's uh, two fifty one p.m. The quarry chest. Oh. So the the flight time is really low. There it is. Twenty two obsidian in the quarry chest. Let's let's just bring him in now. And then we can fly up and get one of the... You know what? Let's go down to here. Um, oh. Okay, so it even does this... It does the uh, timeout when you're going across the water, too. So it's one thing to keep in mind. Oh, oh. Not enough juice. <laughs> I can't... I just can't tell, like, where I'm at on the on the juice bar. It might be the uh, resource pack that I'm using. It's possible. I'm not. I'm not 100 percent sure. I have to wait a second here. Get up there. You can make it. You can make it. You can make it. Yes. Okay. Let's see. Let's use a torch. I don't have the magnetization thing. Oh shoot. Oh, give me that. Let's see. Oh, plenty. Is there? Hey, I want to go down. I want to go down. I want to go down. There we go. Down. I didn't know there was a a way in on that side. Huh? Interesting. Okay, so we got so we've got plenty of. Um, let's see. Let's put it up in here. So we've got plenty of red wool, white wool, and obsidian. We can start. See if we make an ender chest. We can put our quarry farther away and bring the stuff over here, and then I can monitor if the chests are filling up here and, and you know move it around accordingly. So next episode, I say we'll go to the little blaze spawner. It's right on the boat. It's right here. I got a blaze spawner here, and then I think there's some here. There was another place that they were, but there's one in here for sure. So we'll go over there. We'll try and get some um, some blaze rods. I only have two ender pearls. Do I need? Did I need ender pearls? I need one ender pearl so I can make two chests. So we'll do that next episode, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Later.